tracks. That's gonna be happening. He said that out of his own mouth. So, I mean, it only takes a couple of staged events to to uh, bring about complete total chaos to destroy the old world, world system and bring in the new world system. So, in the midst of that, um, people are gonna be going nuts. Like that, once people had that they used to, it's gonna be without. And um, you know, obviously, the goal of this is to, like I said, do away with the old, the old world system. And the way that they're gonna do that is through these different stage psychological operational events. Therefore, bringing the economy down to nothingness, which is what this, this, uh, which is what this one has done, right? And um, they're gonna use other crises, man. And I mean, there's so many ways they can do this. They can, they can, they can stage that with uh, a cyber attack. That could definitely hit them. That could definitely, definitely stifle the economy in itself because most of everything that we use is based on electricity. All right. And if and if you can't get access to electricity due to electrical grids being cut off, then I mean. How can business flow? How can the world operate? You know what I'm saying? Because you need electricity to do just about everything, man. Even when it comes to pumping gas. Those gas machines, in order for you to pump your gas, again, that takes electricity. Or diesel. So if you can't, like I said, if, if electricity is going to be without yeah then again that's going to stop business because it takes these trucks right and you know obviously people drive their cars as well it's going to stop business so when you visit when, when business is stopped there's no economy yeah so you know they could even do that as well they can make a stage an emp attack or a cyber attack whatever you want to call it and um crash this economy and in the midst of that, people are gonna go crazy. People will lose their fucking minds, man. Then you're gonna also have uh, people that are gonna drop dead because they're taking their um, they're taking the venom shots. So I mean, all kind of stuff is getting is getting prepared and ready. Yeah, and all it's gonna take is is your faith. And, and if you did the work, because those that did the work of the Lord, they're gonna they're not gonna get caught up into that. Right? So, you know, the brothers is doing the right thing. The brothers is on the right-hand side of the Lord. We ain't got nothing to worry about that, man. We don't have nothing to worry about when it concerns these um, events, which is going to take place. The ones that should be worrying are those that are um, not doing the Lord's work. They should be the ones worrying. Like we get on this guy, um, Al-Azhar, from the Sakari Gap. Showing you the scriptures he's going off, he's wrong, and he don't want to repent. So, and it's just not just him, but it's, it's many men like him. He's just one out of many, right? So if he don't get his act together, which I don't see that that's going to be the case anyway, then um he's going to get caught into those flakes. That's the deal. But like I was saying. We don't really have nothing to worry about. If we're doing the right thing, and we're putting in that work, and our attitude is right, we don't have shit to worry about. So, Read verse 3 again. When they shall say peace, the same thing, then sudden destruction come up upon them, as shall build them on the name of the child, and they shall not stand on the same thing. They will not be on the same thing. Thank you. 
it on the property, man. It's, 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 good, it's good as it was usually. As the scripture says, make sin. Shall we make shop sin? Make sin. Make I get more comfortable and more comfortable as everything is seems to be back to square one again. And then all of a sudden, another another cyber is gonna occur, man. And um, I mean I don't know if I should say cyber, because it's gonna meet many cybers. It could very it could very be multiple of cybers, or it could just be a cyber. But I, I, I beg to believe it's going to be multiple because they got to convey the point more powerfully that so that they can get their agenda going more effectively. The more the merrier, you know? So yeah, I mean, a lot of people are receiving visions nowadays of things which is forth to come, man. And I believe it was what? I think the week before that I had another vision, which I've already expounded upon now, on how um, I was walking on water, and uh, you know my faith was waning a little bit, so when my faith waned a little bit, my anger was To that and uh, and uh, you know that was pretty much it right there. But then the next following week, as I'm discussing this vision here that I had of um, Master Rest happening, you know, so right now it looks like everything's cool. But again, we got we got that act. Gotta be easy. Um, my shoes all messed up. I mean, I got the right shoes on, but they're not that strong to deal with this this dirt. But yeah, um, like I was saying, things are gonna start happening out here, man, and it's not gonna be good. You know, people are so caught up into um, you know, these COVID laws not being. Uh, in activation no more so now all of a sudden everything's normal people have a little sense of joy in their heart because of it but like I said and as the scripture says that sudden destruction will come up upon them as a woman travail with child it's kind of like when a woman is pregnant and then suddenly her water breaks Letting her know that she's about to she's about to give birth. So uh, that's how the evil times are gonna come suddenly upon the people. See? And I mean we should welcome it. Well obviously we do because we're in our right state of mind.
Christian saints, which is what we are in this race. There's no salvation in this last verse. We know this is very, this is very clear. This is very clear. You know, you look at your reality, and it's clear. So, but there, there is a salvation in something else, and the salvation is going to be through your Howard shot, man. But in order for your Howard shot to make a second return, um, this world has to go through what it has to go through. In order for that to happen, in order for us to get to the next level, in order for us to ultimately receive the kingdom. So, you know, that's just the bottom line, man. And like I said, we welcome this, as we should. Because if nothing happens here, then we won't, we won't get to the next level where we need to be. So, uh, you know. Yeah, man, it's going to be all kind of... Um, Especially, we know it's not going to end well in this world. 